All right, you guys, it's about that time for another Fave Trip Collaboration! That's right, now make sure you click Fave Trip in the title of the video and hit subscribe, because if you don't, the next video you get will not be the 2 million subscriber special. In fact, I might just drag that one into the recycle bin, but that's up to you guys. Now today, we are going to be paying attention to this car, which I thought was a BMW, but I wasn't 100% sure, and in this day and age, the last thing you want to do is mismodel a vehicle, so I went to Facebook to see what everybody else else thought and now I'm more confused than ever. Looks like a Mercedes to me. Benzo, definitely Benz. See them every day at work. That car's a Mercedes Benz. Hey, look at the taillights. It's a BMW 5 Series. Mercedes looks like a Mercedes. Definitely a 5 Series BMW. I'm gonna go with an Nike RL. Definitely not a Benz at all. I don't know. I think it's a BMW. BMW. Volkswagen. That is not a BMW. Benz. Looks like a Mercedes. Infinity. Buick LaCrosse. So I decided to show them the back end, you know, because that's what I really thought looked like a Beamer. And I'm getting a uh, Mercedes for sure. Damn, might even be a 7 Series. Eh, maybe a Genesis. Maybe a BMW. Maybe a Hyundai Genesis. Yeah, it's a BMW. Looks like a 5 Series. Definitely a BMW. BMW owner 535i. Uh, no, it looks like Mercedes. Could be a Genesis. Maybe a Mercedes Benz. So I went through all the comments and the consensus was Benz, Benz, Beamer, Beamer, Benz, Benz, Beamer, Beamer, Benz, Benz, Beamer, 5 Series, no C300 Mercedes, Benz, 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 Beamer, 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 Benz, 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 Benz. No, it's definitely a 5 Series BMW. I own one. It's an older model. No, it's definitely a C300 Mercedes. I own one. Wait a minute. Look at the single exhaust in the back. Yeah, Mercedes don't have single exhaust. Wait a minute. Look at the chrome trim around the windows. Yeah, that's a BMW for sure. No, but look at the headlights. Those are definitely Mercedes headlights. So what we're going to call it is a BMW C300. So the BMW C300, which seems like too nice of a vehicle for somebody who feels the need to conceal merchandise, is going to pull up to pump four. <laughs> So he's going to get out of his BMW, which in this case stands for Beamer Mercedes Wagon. So he's going to make his way around his car, and obviously he needs some fuel. I mean, why else would you park at a pump? So he's going to look back, make sure he is on pump four, and you are correct, little buddy. So he's going to make his way towards the store. He's going to open up that door, and he's going to make his way inside. He's going to look to the right, then he's going to look to the left up at the counter. You know, you got to make sure that cashier is busy, and he is. He's taking care of a drive through right now, so he's going to make his way around that rack right there and uh oh looks like he forgot to take the sticker off his hat somebody needs to let him know i mean obviously you're not gonna leave stickers and tags on any of your other clothes right so he's gonna make his way back here towards the coolers because he wants a delicious beverage so he's gonna reach in there he's gonna pull out the fiji water because you know he's got expensive taste and he's going to have a problem he's trying to slip that fiji into his right jacket pocket come on now yep come on just a little more a little more yep you got it so he conceals the fiji water in his jacket pocket and he's going to double check that ATM, make sure no money's in it, and there's none, so he's gonna hit us with the look of confusion before... Good evening, I have a security team here, cashier, there was the male customer in the store who was wearing black colored jacket, he was hiding one can. Is there a can? Customer at the counter, could you please take out can from your pocket and put it on the counter? I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, I have water in my pocket. So let's recap what happened. He walked into the store, he walked back to the cooler, he opened up a cooler door, he reached in there, he pulled a bottle of water out, and then he comes up to the counter with nothing in his hands. Nothing weird about that, but clearly the live eye in the sky was onto him right away, and once he realizes that, he finally says, oh, I got a water in my pocket, but that doesn't help the cashier, so he finally says, oh, I got a Fiji water bottle in my pocket, but that also doesn't help the cashier. I mean, obviously, if you've ever been shopping before, you know the cashier needs to scan the item, so finally the live eye in the sky hits him with the, take it out of your pocket, we're watching you live, and he finally pulls it out and says I was going to pay for it but that means nothing in the great state of Missouri because any person willfully concealing unpurchased merchandise of any mercantile establishment shall be presumed to have concealed such merchandise with the intention of committing a wrongful taking of such merchandise and the finding of such unpurchased merchandise concealed upon the person shall be evidence of reasonable grounds and probable cause to detain and instigate criminal proceedings against such person aka Missouri is one of the last states you want to conceal merchandise in. She gone!